forget you and you and you you defend corruption and we all hate you whatever well how's it going people pasco county sheriff's office corruption part one read the description here's what elizabeth f had to say about my video where they denied me access to the media staging area claiming i had to id when i didn't violating 42 usc 1983 and florida statutes 901.151 she's cool with all that probably because she doesn't know so this is what elizabeth f had to say retired detective sergeant wife retired detective slash sergeant's wife here this is how you talk yourself into jail i didn't realize you could talk yourself into jail unless there's corrupt cops because talking is not illegal right elizabeth you're being obnoxious. That's not illegal either, Elizabeth. They were breaking the law. 42 U.S.C. 1983 and 901.151 of the Florida statutes. People that always say they know their rights usually don't. Well, I'm not one of those people, Elizabeth. If you hadn't been so damn disrespectful, they wouldn't have messed with you. Oh, how come they messed with me to begin with since I wasn't breaking any laws? And it wasn't under any of their jurisdiction. They didn't have the right to detain me in the first place. That doesn't bother you either, huh, Elizabeth? You went into this looking into looking to fight. No, I didn't. I went to go to the media staging area unmolested by guys with guns. And that couldn't happen for some reason in my own neighborhood. And then they wouldn't let me go home. You're kind of silly, Elizabeth. People like you and those sovereign citizen idiots are cops' worst nightmare. First of all, the sovereign citizens in this country are police uh, and judges. Judges have sovereign immunity and police have uh, qualified immunity. And people who investigate themselves, Elizabeth, are sovereign from the rest of us. That's what a sovereign citizen is. Uh, there, There's a reason sovereign, whatever you're calling a sovereign, guys like me, I'm a constitutionalist. Police swore an oath to the Constitution, but they're trained to violate it. So that's the only reason I would be a cop's worst nightmare because their policies and procedures go against the Constitution they swore to protect. Maybe you should look into that, Elizabeth. You won't win in the end, though. My husband used to tell those people, we're not driving to jail, we're traveling to jail. That's hilarious. Actually, no, what your husband did was commit armed kidnapping and uh, false imprisonment unless there was a victim or damages so you're a brainwash moron you're you're completely biased because you're married to a, a blue liner blue waffle and i'm sorry that you're not that you don't have the critical thinking ability to understand reality reality is the bill of rights and constitution are what the police sworn oath to you're sitting here defending them violating it it's obvious you're a cop's wife and i believe you because you don't understand the laws or the principles of the United States. Right on. Have a nice day, Elizabeth.